The president got his revenues on January the 1st. Now it's time to get serious about solving the spending problem. Speaker of the House John Boehner may have a line in the sand on taxes, but you will almost never find him with a wrinkle in one of his ties. He is a sartorial splendor on the Hill, known almost as much for his perfectly knotted ties as his permatan. Oh, good to see you. Thank so you when we sat down for an interview, I was surprised when he took note of my own neckwear. I have a Do you? I got it from my wife. But I conceded that given the speaker's superior knot skills, my tie probably looks better on him, which he pretty much agreed with. You don't have a dimple in it. You have a dimple in it. Well, when we're done here, can I get a lesson? Yeah, I'll show you. I, it does not hard. So after we finished talking about his slim hopes for a grand bargain and his commitment to have a vote on immigration legislation this year, class began. Start over again. I'm going to bring it up. Okay. Now, bring it through. Yeah. Easily. Now put your your left thumb. Left underneath thumb. There. It's there. Underneath, underneath here. Yeah. Right. No, back behind all of it. All right. Back here. Yeah. Okay, Pull gotcha. down gently. Yeah. All right. Then here, watch out, watch out. So you got to train these my, ties. I think it's my tie. Who did better? So the speaker may not have tied the knot with the president on any grand bargain, but at least he's improved my knot. When I chase you in the hallway next, you take a look and see what uh, see what uh, it looks like. Peter Cook, Bloomberg, Washington.